Okay, we gotta go over here. You're not gonna believe this garden. I've let the squash grow out over the lawn, and this has just happened in the last few weeks. It's just huge. But look in here. Look in here. And we can keep these over the winter. There's two big ones there. There's another one there. <laughs> oh my God, no, that's a rock. You <laughs> thought that was one. <laughs> They're growing like crazy. Now we, and there's, look at when you look through the fence, there's another one. We're gonna be storing lots of squash. Now, before we go in the garden, okay, I watered the garden this morning and then we had a thunderstorm. Sunny now, but <laughs> you're not going to believe this. I haven't been weeding. I haven't been doing nothing. Next year I will be better. <laughs> I promise. Look at pumpkin and that tiny little thing beside the pumpkin is a cantaloupe. <laughs> and there's lots of cucumbers. Oh, I just, because it was so hot, I haven't been out doing what I should be doing. But look at this. Here's a pumpkin. This is growing out of the garden. Here's a pumpkin. And then over here, one decided to lay in the bushes. There's another pumpkin. Oh my goodness, I don't know where they all are. There's another one down here. <laughs> I don't know, they're just everywhere. And and look at this, look at this. It's a jungle. Anyway, next year I'm gonna buy this rubber and I'm gonna run, lay, you can see the tomatoes. Now I got one batch, I think I'll, I'll can some sauce on Sunday. But I haven't wanted to thin them because <laughs> if I thin them, they'll get burnt in this continuing sunshine. So, Let's go in for a minute. I'm not proud of it at all. And I've been picking peaches. There's a few left on the tree. <laughs> it's not a, a, a lot this year, but... Okay, here we come in. This is that one squash plant. One squash plant. And I am sure there's more squash under here. This goes for miles. <laughs> it goes over this way. Let's look in here. I don't know. Oh boy, there's one over there. I see. One. Oh boy. And then these are the beets. And these are weeds. But the beets are healthy. And I'm going to be uh, cooking some and freezing them in butter. Creole packing them. That's potatoes over there. But the beets are, I mean, the leaves are healthy. It's just Carolyn hasn't been coming out here and weeding. I don't want to make you dizzy. Tomatoes had a bad year because we had all that pouring rain. But luckily, there's, there's lots coming. And there's enough to probably do one batch on Sunday. But because of all the heat, they started to get a little sunburnt, some of them. And we've been eating the sunburnt ones first. And I don't dare top them because they need all the sh Oops, it's slippery because it's so wet. So this is the other side of this row. See my weeds? I'm going to run rubber up here next year. So, like here's a big one. And that's sunburn. But the bottoms are good and they are delicious. They're not real, um, they have lots of meat. So there's, you know, more, but I, and they're beautiful tomatoes. They're just beautiful. I'm going to make Brian jealous. Okay, I have a few Romas, and they've been kind of falling off, but they're just thick. They're, oh, there's mosquitoes in here, and I'm getting bit. If, if they'll come up, it can be 200 degrees, they'll come out. In there is Romas. So over here we have, um, some more squash. I love squash and it's so good for you. And I have some red cabbage and cucumbers. There's a cucumber down there. I'll come. But they're coming steady. This is just crazy. 
I can't even go in there and show you because I'm in my slip-ons. <laughs> oh my god, it's a jungle. And I'm not giving up, but I'm just going to be smarter. <laughs> There's Maggie enjoying the sun. The sun is all out. The storm is gone. So she's out enjoying it. Yeah, you're enjoying it. So everything else is just that it's, it's, we needed that rain. It was better than nothing. And that's it. i got to undo this and probably hopefully got it all on. 